वेलकम बैक गाइस सो इन टूडे लेक्चर वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट व्हाट इज स्टैंडर्ड मॉड्यूल्स बिफोर दैट वी हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस अबाउट द नेविगेशन ऑफ द गिवन पैन व्हिच इज डिस्प्लेइंग राइट नाउ एंड व्हाट आर द डिटेल्स वी हैव ऑलरेडी इन दिस पर्टिकुलर की एलिमेंट्स वी हैव सो लेट्स बिगिन विद स्टैंडर्ड मॉड्यूल्स सो फर्स्ट the question arises what is standard modules okay so standard modules is nothing but predefined modules already created by tosca tricentis for us so if you will see here uh, this particular folder is known as standard modules and if you will click on the drop down you can see all the basic elements which are away, uh, which are present here okay so you can use them for your testing purpose for test automation so the question arises why we need this standard modules so if you will see there are thousands of software applications available in the market more or less we can relate that almost every applications shares the same kind of web elements or the controls or the basic element you can say and the functions so to avoid the repetition and to make our work easier to do not uh, waste our resources money and time creating modules again and again uh, we have predefined standard modules present in in our system it can be basic window operations it can be process operations or it can be uh, sap uh, applications everything is available it's up to you what kind of testing you are going to do if there are some complex application available in that case we can go for the x scan which we which we, we will discuss in our further lectures but for our basic uses we can use this particular standard modules so how to get it in our system so as i i have shown in my previous lecture if you will create your workspace you can use this subset standard modules comes as a part of the tricenti standard subset you can take it from there and load it or import it and it will come in this particular format so you can see it in this way so guys if you suppose you have this particular folder and you will drag it to test cases and you will leave it to work your new test case has been created okay you can use it but how to use it or how to do all these things we will discuss in our further lectures now suppose you want to know the objects or the details about your particular uh mapped uh test case or the modules you can come here and you can see it if you cannot see description here just click right click and choose the column chooser and you can see all the option which is required now search for description drag it here okay now you can see everything you can see everything here okay let's ex expand it optional the environment from which to take the screenshot okay name of the file everything is given here okay so this description will help you understand what the particular thing uh, say, uh, is saying so in this way we got an idea of standard modules we will Uh, learn more things in our further lectures and we will connect that what we were doing in our previous lecture like what is standard module in more clear way but for this particular lesson you have uh, i i i think got the 100% idea of what is standard module and why we use it and what we can do with the standard modules and uh, how we can understand the description part of this module so till then thank you guys